Hello family and friends, welcome to Cooking with Chef Khalil. Today we're gonna do our vegan Bermavera. For the first time ever, creamy and vegan will come in same sentence. So we're gonna do vegan creamy Bermavera dish over fettuccine. The way how we're gonna go about this dish is think about the colors and the aroma we want in our dish. So we first gonna start with this beautiful capsicum right here, and we're gonna start roasting real quick some of this capsicum, carrot, and pumpkin in the oven real quick. The carrot real quick here. What you do is you peel your carrot a little bit, and then slice it thin, and put it in your uh, roasting pan right here. And this is some pumpkin right there. And here we go, that beautiful colors, once it's roasting, it's going to change it 360 degree. So we first got the pumpkin, we get the capsicum, and we get the carrot. And now we're gonna have a little bit of olive oil right there and some crushed peppers right there and salt. Here you go. Leave that little vegetable to roast for a while and come back after the sauce is all adding up. We'll get back to this in exactly five to 10 minutes under 360 degree Fahrenheit. So this is all going into the oven. While this going, we're getting the garlic. Side our pan, a little garlic olive oil, and basil. What I have here is some beautiful mushroom. We're gonna slice our mushroom real quick, throw it inside. Ladies and gentlemen, now the aroma inside your home is amazing. That mushroom is working as a sponge, sucking all of, all of your oil, all of your garlic, and all the aroma, all together. So here we go. What I'm doing at the moment is toasting my mushroom and basil and garlic all together inside my pan to suck all the oil. Now, next thing I'm adding here is my coconut cream. And this is what I was talking about. How can we get the creamy and vegan together? So the creamy and vegan together can only be done even if you're using creamy coconut cream or non-dairy product. So here we go. We can all together here, add in my vegetable stock into the same pan and let it simmer. So while this cooking, I'm cooking my pasta right now. So I have this amazing egg-free fettuccine pasta. So this is what I use for that particular dish. This way it can be 100% vegan. The faster way to cook your pasta is to have your kettle on and prepare your hot water. This is, doesn't take no more than three seconds. What are we talking about here? Your hot water is boiling, you put it in your pan and throw in your pasta. Three to five minutes, you have this amazing al dente pasta. And this is exactly what you're looking for. You really do not want to have a soft, overcooked pasta. You're always looking for this adante, smooth, nice pasta. So here we go. We get our boiling water inside here. Can you believe this is cooking like crazy? Now we have our pasta right on. So now we have everything going. We have our sauce simmering with coconut and mushroom and your vegetable stocks. Basil, garlic, aroma, and flavor all adding up together and your pasta is cooking in your pan. So using that fork and chicken in our pasta, you wanna make sure your pasta's al dente and it's ready to go. So the way how I tasted that personally, I will steal one of these pasta, make sure nobody's around and give it a little bite. Check inside here, so you're kinda leaving it with a little bit of structure or a backbone and it's now ready to go. I can easily tell you my pasta is boiling nicely and the sauce is making all the aroma coming out from the stove. So now simply you just kind of want to fish out your pasta and have it with this little bit of water and steam coming out straight into your sauce. So now what we're doing is the starch from your pasta is going straight into your sauce and you mix it kind of slowly, slowly together where you're having that pasta cooks a little longer with your sauce, so it can kind of observe all this coconut and mushroom and basil and garlic aroma inside your pasta. Now it looks all beautiful as you can easily see right there, that pasta. Now our pasta, coconut and mushroom and creamy sauce all adding up together. It smells amazing in the house and it looks even great. So now I'm gonna put all this dish together with all the colorful vegetable and cream and mushroom and broccoli and capsicum and I'm telling you this is a vegan party ladies and gentlemen this is what I call the vegan dream 
to have it all creamy, saucy, beautiful, broccoli, vegetables. So I'm adding some broccoli as well inside here. And check this out. The story has not been end yet. Vermavera, ladies and gentlemen, means vegetable, means colors. <laughs> you kidding me or what? Here is some carrot to make it all finish. And beautiful red capsicum right in the middle. And pumpkin. So we get all these colors all together here. And now we're gonna finish up with some beautiful Parmesan cheese that's vegan. Vegan Parmesan cheese tastes and smells exactly like the real Parmesan. And just complete that dish. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And this, ladies and gentlemen, what I call the vegan dream. It's creamy, it's vegetarian, and beautiful. And it smells amazing. If you have a vegan friend or family, this is how we surprise them and make them happy.